Major League Baseball and the Players Union are trying to work towards a common goal of a return to play. But the longer that they bicker over money, the greater the chance that their minor league teams won't have a season at all. We're still holding out a little bit of hope until they tell us that it's over. Nashville Sounds general manager Adam News says he told his staff he never thought they'd be at this point. So far, the Sounds have missed 53 out of their 140 game season. But despite losing that revenue, the club hasn't cut or furloughed any employees. I think we're one of the only teams out of 160 teams that have not. Um, but a lot of that is because we have, uh, over the last couple of years, shown that we can do events like glow and soccer and concerts. Um, so we've kind of put all our uh, eggs in the basket that, hey, if there's not baseball this year, that we're going to find something else that's going to create some revenue. And that will be the challenge heading into these next two months, which are usually the team's most lucrative. But June and July is really our wheelhouse for, for generating revenue. Those are our sellout crowds and, and big days. Fourth of July is going to be a major hit to miss. If there is a glimmer of hope, reportedly one of the caveats of Major League Baseball's return to play would be an expanded roster for each team, as well as a practice squad of 20 players. News is hoping that group for the Texas Rangers could play in Nashville. The taxi squad's got to play somewhere, so uh, it does make sense that they play in Arizona and Florida, but there's also uh, could be scenarios that cities like Nashville and Louisville and Memphis uh, were all close that we could take on these these teams. The Rangers are still paying their minor league players the $400 per week stipend and plan to through the end of the month. Meanwhile, Noose and his staff are looking to find new revenue streams for the summer should the players not return to First Horizon Park. Chris Harris, News 4 Nashville.